Um, the hardest moment for me, I would say, is um, definitely opening myself and making myself way more vulnerable for people who don't know me to just say whatever the hell they feel like saying to me. Oh, you're such a lame, you're such a cornball, you suck, you're pathetic, you're trying to use somebody else's name to do this and all that other stuff, but I'm like, I'm on national television. I don't need to use anybody else's name to do anything, so try again. I just feel like I've done so much in the past, you know, just in far, as far as being in entertainment, that I feel very used to it. It's like sometimes the cameras are on me and I just feel like the cameras aren't even on me. Like, I really forget that they're on me. Like, I forget that the mic is on me. It's like, it's, you know, it's a very natural, smooth process. My favorite moments have been, um, you know, all of my stuff uh, on my motorcycle. I love riding my motorcycles and doing wheelies and stunt riding and stuff like that. Um, my, my, my fitness moments, working out with the guys and, you know, being caressed and rubbed down by a beautiful hot woman. The girl, her name is Miss Nikki, baby. She's a very uh, beautiful, um, round lady who is, um, you know, very successful has her own lingerie line. Her family owns a lot of real estate and strip clubs and stuff like that, you know? So it's just, you know, me and her, we, we're two very hot and greasy coconut oil looking bodies by swimming pools that look good together. So it'll make good for TV. So make sure you're watching it. When people see me now, nobody has to say, oh, that's such and such as X. Like, they know who I am, they know where they know me from, you know? So, if they do say that, it's just because they want to say it, but and at the most part, they know who I am. And a lot of people, they think that they have to be famous for me to like them or date them, but you know, I, I'm definitely cool with dating someone who is not into entertainment business. Actually, I'd rather date someone who's not in the entertainment business, who doesn't even keep up with all of this, because it's good when you can have someone that is an escape from, you know, all of the lights, cameras, and action.